colorful. They've got a funny name and a big appetite. Eastern lubber grasshoppers can grow to be three inches long, and their merciless munching mandibles can make mincemeat of your plants. And this time of year, Florida's Gulf Coast is a hot spot for these things. Fox 13's Jordan Bowen is looking into what you can do to protect your garden from these hungry hoppers. This is an eastern lubber grasshopper. They just eat the edge of the leaf. And this is a look at the type of damage they can do. The eggs hatch in the spring, like March, April. They start off as little, tiny, little black caterpillars. They go through five instars and get bigger each time. And then the adult form is very large, like three inches. They usually reach adult size in midsummer. By July and August is when they're at their peak. These babies just hatched in the garden at the University of Florida's Institute of Food and Agricultural Sciences, Hillsborough County Extension, and already feeding on the plants. Grasshoppers will start eating on the edge and the tips of the plants, and their favorite plants are like lilies, crinum lilies, amaryllis. They also eat just like broadleaf things, like if you're growing a vegetable garden, kale, uh, citrus. You can use insecticides on plants to protect them, but because of the grasshopper's large size and ability to detoxify natural toxins, they often prove difficult to kill. It's why removing them may be your best option. You can get a bucket of soapy water and just knock them into the bucket of soapy water and then that will kill them. As Tia Silvesi with the extension explains, if you do use insecticide, be sure to follow the directions on the label and use PPE when administering it. We encourage IPM, integrated pest management, so, you know, having a healthy garden that some of the natural predators, like the birds, will be around to eat them. Also, just using least toxic pest controls first. Reporting in Tampa, Jordan Bowen, Fox 13 News.